This is the iPhone 3GS complete backlight repair kit. So what you're going to be receiving this repair kit is one 6 i coil. This is called the backlight coil for the iPhone 3GS. This is the iPhone backlight IC for 3GS. It's the 109 IC. It has a 6, actually 8 connection, but 6 uh, connection that's actually used. These, very important, these are two backlight filters for iPhone 3GS. Uh, they located right behind the 6i coil and so the 6i coil and the 109 IC is located on the top side of let's say it's the top side of the iPhone board for 3GS. These two are located on the back side. Please refer to our website cyberdog.lc for the detailed pop placement picture for the backlight filters. These since these are right before the, this is the next steps right before the LCD connector. So these two are usually the first thing that to go. Even you can probably have a usually have a six i coil that's fine, uh, one on nine IC that's fine, but the backlight filter always goes off first. So you want to change these two filters first, and then you can go on the uh, coils. It's easier to change and IC. In order to do any of this repair, you need to use a desoldering alloy quick alloy. So we're including you a piece of quick alloy which for you to do this repair. The concept is very simple. Quick alloy has a low melting temperature. So the melting temperature of the original solder is about 300 degrees Celsius or 250 degrees precise. That's very hard to use. At 300 degrees Celsius, you can, it's enough heat to burn the board. So there's several methods to desoldering the coil, the filters, and even the backlight IC. You can use a higher gun, which is imprecise, using a fine needle soldering tip, which is also difficult to use, and you don't get enough heat. Or a soldering tweezer, which not everybody have. So a quick alloy, desoldering alloy, is the best shot to finish this repair easily and without damaging any components since this alloy melts at such a low temperature and it's going to keep everything in nice and low temperature for you to work with. Um, also these two filters, when you need to change them, they're very small, they're very fragile. It's very easy to melt them off the board if you use really hot temperature or just break off the solder pad, which is what you don't want to do. That's where the quick alloy comes in place. You want to use this alloy for desoldering. It will also help with the soldering, as you can see from our um, repair video. So visit cyberdogllc.com or our YouTube channel for how to complete repair, how to use the quick alloy in iPhone 3GS backlight repair. This, you're going to also get this. It's a 3cc of Cyberdog no clean flux. So you're gonna be needing flux throughout this repair. You're gonna you want to use a lot of flux. Never, never be cheap on the flux. This flux is not corrosive and it's not clean. You still want to wipe it off on the board because otherwise it's just gonna be you know it it just look unprofessional if you have flux over the board. Even no no clean and um, non acidic reactive flux still needs to be clean off the board. No clean is just it's just a name for the it has minimum residue left on board, but you you still want to wipe it out of alcohol. So basically, you're gonna and also I don't like to be cheap on the flux. You should use flux whenever you need for repairs. So this is why you get three cc. But you really don't need that much. You the most you probably only gonna need half a cc like this much here for this whole repair, maybe 1cc because you have so many components at different locations. But you have 3cc, so don't be cheap with the flux. Buy this repair kit, and it comes with 6i coil, 109 IC, and two backlight filters, very important. Quick alloy is, is included as a bonus for you to do the repair and also as a sample. The CyberDoc no clean flux is there for you to do this repair as well and also it's more like a sample it's not really needed for backlight repair per se you can use your own flux but if you, the flux is given to you for free then um, why not use it it's it's just much better flux thank you for watching again this is iPhone 3GS backlight repair of the 6i coil and backlight filters